had a check engine light on this it came in after an oil change they had a p2279 that's an intake system leak so every little scrap of air that goes into this has to be measured and then balanced with the correct amount of fuel injected in so that it has stoichiometric balance basically you got to have the right recipe the right mixture for it to go pop go bang so after an oil change what hose what pipe what tube of all of this tubing and pipes and hoses especially being a turbo uh, tdi not tdi gti this isn't diesel it's gasoline but basically i had to figure out what the deal was most of the time you pull off the idiot hood you access this system which works to basically counter the engine inflating like a balloon this is like a pcv system but a little bit different and the diaphragm on this guy always fails some of these engines they're mounted the other way on the side but that's usually what it is so i went to inspect that i went to inspect hoses and check everything out and i saw a couple of videos where they're talking about the rear main seal on these tsi 2.0 liter engines having air get sucked in through the rear main seal and i thought that's crazy you know that's some real negative pressure pcv stands for positive crankcase ventilation and initially you had to vent the engine a little tube went to the ground this is in like the early 1910s that they were doing that and then they came up with positive crankcase ventilation pcv valves with a little ball a little check valve and then that would go to the intake so it wouldn't come up as a vacuum leak or suck too much but it would basically meter just a little bit through the system what this ended up being is you can see this dirt and crud from where it's had spills when the oil was changed when the oil was changed last he took off the cap and some of this got wiped off or cleaned up or whatever a little housekeeping some of that got on this inner seal you see it's not like a fat o-ring around the side like most oil filler caps it's kind of a spring-loaded plastic design unless this is rubber it feels kind of hard if it is anyway this hardened rubber on the crud that was sitting on that lip caused it to have air being sucked in and then that air that was sucked in was unmetered went through this system into the intake and voila you have unmetered air getting in and it caught that isn't that crazy i've never seen an oil filler cap cause uh a lean condition or an unmetered air condition.